हेलो एवरीवन आई एम शुभांगनी मनवेश अ फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट फ्रॉम बनस्थली विद्यापीठ आई हैव डन सिक्स मंथ्स इंटर्नशिप अंडर मिस्टर संजय कुमार साइंटिस्ट ई एट साइंटिफिक एनालिसिस ग्रुप डीआरडीओ माय टॉपिक ऑफ प्रोजेक्ट इज रिवर्सिबल डेटा हाइडिंग यूजिंग मशीन लर्निंग इन दिस प्रेजेंटेशन वी विल बी कवरिंग वॉट इज डेटा हाइडिंग रिवर्सिबल डेटा हाइडिंग इट्स एप्लीकेशन एडवांटेजेस देन रिवर्सिबल डेटा हाइडिंग यूजिंग मशीन लर्निंग why machine learning is needed different concepts of machine learning data reversible data hiding techniques and its implementations its limitations future scopes and conclusion and then lastly references as you all know drdo is a confidential place with a very high security the work done here is highly confidential all the important data are hidden in some ways so from there i got a topic data hiding after exploring i found reversible data hiding much interesting topic to work upon it so starting from what is data hiding data hiding is a process of embedding secret data into a dig- digital medium like images videos audios etc such that no change is visible and that image look same as it was before for applications such as medical imaging forensic applications where integrity of original data is equally important from there the need of reversible data hiding technique came into the picture reversible data hiding is a recent res- research field of information security for secured digital data transmission reversible data hiding is a technique for embedding data into a cover medium in a way that the original cover image or medium can be perfectly perfectly recovered after the embedded data is extracted here in the image you can see sender is sending the confidential information by embedding the data into a cover image now the data hidden image is same as the original image no change is visible now at the receiver end data is extracted and the image is recovered from data hidden image you can see we get both the confidential data as well as original medium without any distortion or any loss this is what called reversible data hiding where we get both the data and the original image after extracting the data from it applications of reversible data hiding medical imaging reversible data hiding technique can be used to embed patient record uh, such that medical records within medical images this allow for secured storage storage and transmission of sensitive patient information while maintaining integrity and quality of medical images confidential data protection reversible data hiding can be used to protect con- confidential data during transmission or storage by embedding data into a cover medium and it can be retrieved without any loss when needed digital watermarking reversible data hiding is used in digital watermarking applications watermarks which contains copyright information ownership details can be embedded within the cover medium similarly in forensic applications multimedia authentications etc are the applications of reversible data hiding there are many advantages of reversible data hiding such as data integrity the original image can be restored after is extracting the hidden data without any loss capacity for hidden data it allows a significant amount of additional information within the cover without noticeably altering the cover size or quality security and confidentiality it allows confidential data exchange without attracting suspicion or drawing any attention watermarking and authentication it allows for the embedding of invisible watermarks or authentication codes within media files enabling copyright protection ownership verification and temper detection 
flexibility and versatility. Reversible data hiding technique can be applied to various types of data including images, videos, audios and text. Hence, so, uh, suitably for wide range of suitable it, hence it is suitable for wide range of applications. So here comes my main topic, reversible data hiding using machine learning that is hiding the data with the help of machine learning technology. Its goal is also similar to reversible data hiding that is hiding data within content while maintaining the ability to completely recover the original content without any loss or distortion. Why reversible data hiding using machine learning? Machine learning is a subfield of artificial intelligence that enables computers to learn and make predictions without being explicitly programmed. It helps in enhancing efficiency, effectiveness, security with its feature extraction, embedding strategy, data uh, prediction, optimization features. It uh, is simpler, faster and more secure. So moving towards few machine learning and deep learning algorithms that we used in implementation. Convolutional Neural Network CNN. It is a deep learning algorithm commonly used for image classifications, object detections, etc. For learning purpose, I created two projects based on CNN. The first one is dog cat image classification and the second one is potato disease classification. Dog cat image classification is a model that success successfully classifies the images of dogs and cats. The second uh, potato disease classification it is a basically a project for helping farmers to detect the disease in the plants so that plant can be treated on time. Now how CNN based reversible data hiding works? It contains four phases training phase, embedding phase, data embedding phase, extraction phase. In training phase a pair of host data and corresponding data is trained using CNN model. In embedding phase, the host data is divided into blocks then CNN will predict if the embedded data is present or not in that specific block. Now in the third phase data is modified according to CNN prediction. Now the modified data is embedded into blocks such that change is minimum. In extraction phase, modified data is processed by trained CNN model again. CNN will predict the presence and absence of embedded data in each block and the embedded data is retrieved based on prediction and difference between original and modified block. Support Vector Machine SVM. Uh, it is a supervised learning algorithm commonly used for classification. SVM is used to predict location which is best for embedding. Now how SVM based reversible data hiding works? Again it contains four phases training phase, embedding phase, data embedding phase and extraction phase. In training phase a pair of extracted features from host data and corresponding data which to be embedded is trained using SVM model. In embedding phase, the host data is divided into blocks, then SVM will predict if the block is suitable or not for embedding. Now in the third phase, the data is modified according to SVM prediction. Now the modified data is embedded into the block such that the minimum change has occurred. In extraction phase, modified data is processed by trained SVM model again. SVM will predict if the embedded data is present or not in each block and the embedded data is retrieved based on prediction and difference between original and modified block. So 
Now moving toward the main important part of the presentation that is reversible data hiding techniques implementations. There are many techniques of reversible data hiding but using machine learning is the latest research topic. I have implemented two projects reversible data hiding using uh, during encryption using machine learning based on SVM and uh, CNN prediction based reversible data hiding. Reversible data hiding scheme during encryption using machine learning. In this, researcher proposes RDH scheme that can be used to authenticate data or the owner of the data. In addition, the reversible data hiding techniques provide a way to embed EPR data into medical images before transmission. The EPR data extraction and recovery of original image can be carried out by the receiver. The reversible data hiding scheme embed EPR data during image encryption process. A block wise image encryption technique has been used to obtain the encrypted image with hidden EPR data bits. It, it is a SVM based classification scheme uh, which has been uh, used for data extraction and image recovery process from encrypted image. In the proposed scheme, firstly the grayscale images will be divided into non-overlapping blocks. For better security, the blocks in the original image will be accessed in a pseudo-random way based on data hiding key H. The pseudo-random uh, sequence of integer for encrypting a selected image block will be determined by the secret image bit secret message bit which is going to be embedded into the image block the keys are used uh, in encryption according to the value of message bit for data extraction the and image recovery the receiver should know the decryption key that that is k1 k2 and k3 and the data hiding key that is h the key behind idea behind uh, the key idea behind the data extraction and image recovery process is that the receiver will try to decrypt each of the selected block using all the three uh, different keys now the image block will be given to the trained svm model and it will identify the correctly decrypted version of image block the decryption key used to recover, recover the original image block gives the secret message bit. Hence, we got both the original image and the secret message bit which was embedded in the original image secretly. Now, coming to the second uh, implementation, CNN prediction based reversible data hiding. In this letter, a novel CNN based prediction approach was used uh, by dividing a grayscale image into two sets and applying one set to predict the other set for data embedding. A 8 bit, a 8 -bit grayscale image was first divided into two subsets which can be used to predict each other by using the proposed CNN based predictor. At first, the original image is divided into two subsets, the cross-set image and the dot-set set image. After dividing the original image, the two subset image will be used to train and converse the proposed uh, CNN-based predictor. Now, using CNN, we will get the predicted dot-set image by uh, using cross-set image. Hence, using cross-set image, we have generated a predicted dot set image by using proposed CNN based predictor. Subsequently, dot set image and predicted dot set image are used to reversibly hide, data, uh, hide part of information like W1 and generate the, uh, generate the data hidden dot set image. Similarly, data hidden dot set image is fed into proposed CNN uh, predictor.
to generate the predicted cross set image which is incorporated with cross set image to embed the other part of information w2 to uh, generate the data hidden cross set image after embedding the whole information that is w1 and w2 uh, the data hidden cross set image is uh, added with data hidden dot set image now both will be added to generate the final data hidden image now coming to the data extraction and image recovery part now we have image in which data hidden uh, data is hidden and in return we want original image and that data so the data hidden image is now divided into two subsets with the same partition pattern after that the data hidden uh, dot set image is firstly fed into the proposed cnn predictor to generate the predicted cross set image which is incorporated with uh, data hidden uh, with cross set image to extract the information w2 and recover the original cross set image now the recovered cross set image is fed into proposed cnn predictor to generate the predicted dot set image which is used to recover original dot set image and extract the information w1 subsequently both the recovered images are added together together in spatial domain uh, to uh, recover the original image meanwhile w1 and w2 are combined to recover the information bit that is w hence we got the bo uh, got both the original image and data and by this we have successfully completed reversible data hiding extraction process and the recovery of the image and the message bit a secret message reversible data hiding using machine learning like other techniques has its limitations Cap uh, there is still a difference in amount of hidden data and quality of recovered original data now dependency on uh, dependency on training data hiding and recovery process may vary on host data so the technique developed for one type of data may not be generalized well to other type vulnerability to attack attackers may employ various techniques to uncover hidden information which may lead to uh, dis get distorted image uh, sensitive to noise any modification to host data can affect accuracy and reversibility of hiding process now coming to the future scope machine learning can be used to develop more efficient and secure method for embedding and extraction of data to detect and prevent unauthorized access of hidden data machine learning can be used machine learning can be used to improve the efficiency and security of reversible data hiding scheme that are resistant to attacks machine learning can be used to develop new reversible data hiding schemes overall machine learning has potential to revolutionize reversible data hiding by developing more efficient secure and innovative reversible data hiding scheme and can help to provide to to, pro, to protect other uh, to protect our digital content and to make it more accessible and useful now coming to the conclusion part we have discussed about reversible data hiding learned about machine learning concepts how machine learning is revolutionizing in reversible data hiding technique implemented uh, reversible data hiding technique based on machine learning these are the references thank you hope you enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching